at what's happening in the Indian electoral scene. This is India Election Watch. It was an action-packed day, and day two rather, for Prime Minister Narendra Modi. He was in his constituency of Varanasi in Uttar Pradesh. He filed his nomination papers in 2014. The Prime Minister had won the seat with a thumping majority. This time, he's aiming for an even bigger margin. The BJP is putting its full organizational might behind the Prime Minister's campaign in Varanasi. It was a massive show of strength. A galaxy of leaders from the BJP and allies from the NDA were present, not to mention the large group of BJP supporters that was there to cheer him on. Four people proposed Narendra Modi's candidature. This included the former principal of the Banaras Hindu University's Women's College and the chief cremator of Varanasi. Here is what the Prime Minister said after filing his papers. मुझे जो आशीर्वाद दिए हैं एक प्रकार से कल शाम को पांच बजे से लेकर अगर रात के एक चार छह घंटे निकाल दें शायद इतना लंबा रोड शो बारह पंद्रह घंटे का रोड शो एक काशीवासी ही कर सकते हैं ये बाबा की नगरी माँ गंगा के आशीर्वाद भारत के उज्जवल भविष्य के लिए काशीवासी संकल्पबद्ध है ये जो प्यार ये दुलार ये आशीर्वाद काशीवासियों ने दिए हैं मैं हृदय पूर्वक उनका आभार व्यक्त करता हूँ अर्ली टूडे ही ऑफर प्रेज इन टेम्पल ऑन थर्सडे ही हेल्ड अ मेगा रोड शो and performed the Ganga Aarti. It was a display of his popularity. Lacks of supporters took to the streets. In fact, Prime Minister Modi took two and a half hours to traverse the seven-kilometer route of the road show. His popularity in his constituency was quite visible. He remains the front-runner to win this seat. Back in 2014, he had secured more than six lakh votes. Delhi Chief Minister Edwin K. Jival came a distant second defeated by a margin of more than 3 lakh votes. The show of strength in Varanasi will help the BJP's campaign across India. The images of lakhs of supporters chanting Modi's name leave an impression. The BJP hopes they will energize party workers all over India. It's not just the supporters. The presence of all NDA allies for this event is another masterstroke. It sends out a strong message. It projects the strength of the BJP and of the NDA, their alliance. It looks stable. It looks stronger compared to the fractured opposition. Do note that top leaders of the BJP made a beeline for Banaras for this event. The party wants to show that it stands united behind the Prime Minister. In terms of optics and messaging then, the Banaras Yatra has ticked all the boxes for Narendra Modi.